Hi everyone, CJ9899 here, and in today's video, we're gonna be testing my system sensor CO detectors. So, um, as you remember from when I did my Simplex 4100ES swap, I uh, had two zone labels that uh, if you catched it, they were labeled uh, CO detector ground floor and CO detector second floor. And uh, a couple weeks ago, I finally got around to doing it. So in my house now on the, obviously the second floor and the main floor, I have a system sensor CO1224A, um, I guess 12 slash 24 volt carbon monoxide uh, detector slash alarm. These are tied to the main system in the basement and they uh, all they do is trip a supervisory because I uh, don't really need to have them tripping a full alarm because these already have built in like sounders in them. So I'm just gonna give a quick demonstration. Um, basically how I did it is that this house had a central vac system roughed into it, but obviously it was never fully utilized. So I was able to take the existing cable in the wall that jumped from here down to the uh, first floor and then to the basement. And I fished another wire through the basement just to the first CO detector. And that way both of them have four wires because you need two wires for power and two for the input. So uh, yeah, basically the whole house is now covered with CO detectors. And uh, I'm just gonna give you a demonstration of both floors. So here is the second floor. Just listen for the beeps. My dogs seem to like it. You can hear the panel beeping. So let's go downstairs and acknowledge that one. There's CO detector, second floor. I'm not going to bother turning the lights on here. There it is. The printer's going to do its thing. Zone right there, supervisory. So now let's go back up and do the ground floor. Here we go. that and there's the ground floor all right and a quick reset there it goes now the printer is going to be really loud all right systems back to normal so yeah i just uh i figured it was a good idea to have some co detectors i do have one in the basin and we used to have one on the second floor just a battery powered one but it did reach its uh, expiration, so I thought, hey, perfect time to uh, do this. But uh, anyways, that's it for today, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one.